Doctor, you recently wrote a book about the risk of electromagnetic frequencies. Why did you write that book? What, what sort of tipped you off that maybe this is something that needs to get out there? Being a menopause practitioner, I was hearing from women who were saying, I must be going into early menopause. They had headaches, insomnia, ir irritable. They were going, well, I am so irritable and really tired. And I have a whole questionnaire I have them fill out. And when I looked at that questionnaire, it wasn't hormones on any of these women. So I s spoke to each one really in depth. What's different? What's new? What has changed that you're feeling like this? And the common denominator was that they had had a smart meter, the electrical smart meter that they're now measuring electricity with across the nation and in other countries in the world too. And uh, that was the common denominator. Within weeks or months of that smart meter going on their house, these symptoms. And being a, I'm a clinical laboratory scientist as well as a menopause practitioner, so I, I have a biochemical background. And so when I started researching what the electromagnetic radiation does, there was no doubt about the headaches, the insomnia, you know, the irritability, uh, as well as the fatigue. And I thought, wow, the world needs to hear this. I had written a book about women's hormones. I had written a book about sunscreens, how they're destroying the marine life as well as our bodies because they're so toxic. And I thought, well, okay, so the world needs to hear about these too. And so I spent uh, quite a while researching more in depth and looking at the biochemical, what's happening at the level of the cell. And I, I was horrified, absolutely horrified. They're impacting every cell in our body and every cell in our body is getting holes. I liken it to we're being machine gunned, that we're getting all these holes in our cell membranes, we're getting holes in our protective barriers, our blood brain barrier, our whole gut lining, as well as the placenta. So every aspect of our body is being impacted by these radiations, and so I put that book together to help people understand why they're having their symptoms, why, um, you know, the biochemical reasons for it, and that they really need to start in protecting themselves and, and not expose themselves so much to, to all this radiation because it's really harming us on such a level. It, it, it's absolutely staggering. And I now have a brand new edition um, just this week. Uh, I've updated it, it's second edition, and uh, 100 more pages much more proof, much more, um, all of the electromagnetic sensitive, sensitivity symptoms that people are expressing their feeling, uh, the biochemical reasons behind all of them, they're not psychosomatic. There's a definite biochemical change in the cell which is causing these symptoms.